What's going on guys, it's your boy Angry SA Gamer and uh, today's video is going to be all about this, uh, where is he? The Santa Boom 9 of 9, um, Brute Force, increase attack by 100% in battle, critical hits from heroes, attack and skill deals 1.2 damage, times damage. Um, I don't know if that's going to be effective on him in Anyway, I've got Unholy Pact on him, but um, if I want to see the best damage from the start before he dies, I have to put a, um, a level 8 on him. Remove and put this on Santa. Boom. We can test him with the Unholy Pact later on, but I just want to get a couple of procs off and see what he does. Change and do that. I want to build a full Sunder team because um, yesterday's live stream in guild wars i struggled with this one gunslinger and i changed the sacred light on levanica from S sacred light to sunder and dive keeper die uh, um, gunslinger died instantly basically there's 325,000 witnesses to that so i'm not lying okay but before i start i just need to go and minnow bomb one of my subs because he asked me to really minnow bomb him um, and so we'll do that um, I tried earlier I can't 100% um, even though my minnow is breakthrough level 20 only 97% that's the best I can do and even with Michael I can't do 100% I don't know why it bothers me to no end because I can basically minnow bomb any other base. Oh, there it does it now, 100%. Okay, well, Lord Steel, there's your base, 100% minnow bombed. Okay, let's move on with the Santa Boom. Let's go into Lord Steel's account and attack him with the Santa Boom. And then I want to buff it a bit later on, obviously. See what it can do. I don't know if Santa Boom is prone to stun. He's prone to dying, that's a fact. Boom, dead. Okay. Uh, where's my magic? I really want to see what the Santa Boom can do. Otherwise, I'm going to have to take him into dungeons. Which would be the best option. But even then, I think he would die fairly quickly. I actually have to do a lost battlefield team with him. But I don't have any lost battlefield chances left. So, that's a bummer. I just want to see the amount of damage you can do. Wow. 16%, one boom. But it wasn't spread out like it should be. And he dies. Ha. We're going to have to test him in dungeons. In dungeons. Uh, let's start with insane 1.1. 1. 1. For the most part of it. Um, let's see. Go, Santa, go. Nice. Not bad, eh? For one, for one proc, it's not bad at all. Fifty percent proc twice. Doing pretty well, but he's a softy. He dies to siren. A level 100 siren so that's not good at all but it's not that bad I mean there's n not much you can test him out with why does my eyes look blue weird okay if that's gonna be the case let's see what this guy can do in expert dungeon one hmm this should be a bit of an issue with that angel over there but I guess we'll try that's weak. That's weak. Seriously? Do I have to send Minnow in? I think I have to. Luckily Minnow came in to clear the base. Okay. So I don't think Santa Boom is that strong. But let's get 
Mm, how do I measure him doing damage though? To like a boss or something. Okay, wait, let's keep that on. Um, I'm gonna go into Expert Dungeon 8, Expert Dungeon 10. In Expert Dungeon 8.10, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, I've got all those bosses in the middle. Hopefully, we can get Santa Boom to proc on those bosses. Okay, he's not proccing on them, he's proccing on either side. Let's see. Okay, that was a hit, but I couldn't see the amount of damage it did. There we go. Ah, you missed the bosses, you ass. Come on, hit the boss. There we go. Hmm. I mean, it's, it's not something that would, you know, destroy your base or, or, or your legends. And he's gonna die now. He's gonna end before he dies. Hmm. I don't know. It's difficult. I don't. I don't. To me, I don't know. I don't. I don't think so. me this is not good at all he's gonna die sooner now because he, um, oh, I never replenished okay Santa went the wrong way ah he died before I can even end hmm I don't know how I feel about the Santa though let's see it with Anali packed in seeking now Let's see if we can make a huge difference. And the chance of him proccing where you want him to proc is a bit low. But maybe in a one-on-one -on -one situation like in Lost Battlefield, Hero vs. Hero. I think there you would see a definite difference. Because he'll proc on the legends you want him to. And that's the legends right in front of him. But at this point in time, it doesn't do that. It will take him a while now to get his proc up. But when he does, okay, you sure showed those uh, troops, eh? I'm gonna check your proc on these. Uh... He did. It's not massive. I mean, I wouldn't be worried if I send up a proc on my legends. There's a 500,000 crit there. There's a big one. But not to the extent where I would say, I want to use this guy in my lineup forever. Cooldown 6 seconds. Yero has level 5 self-destruct. That seems fitting. Crest, change back to this. So let's get you on the first proc there, my boy. Um, I, I'm not impressed. I've seen better. Old school legends. It does a lot more damage than that so like I said I'm not impressed but um, I mean whatever much better 29% 41% it's not bad it's not bad at all um, let's see, 161,000 might. Can you stand a chance against my Santa Boom? Okay, let's get a bit of speed on you. Ah, Santa Boom's too weak. Well, I guess that's it for this video, guys. Um, if you think I should do anything different I don't I don't think I have enough level 5 uh, level 9 talent runes 22 I can I have to use 10 of those for whichever legend you're gonna choose for the challenge ATB and myself have Ah, uh, MVZ sorry not ATB MVZ 10 of those goes to that challenge the other 10 I can use on whatever but I don't think I'll waste that egg smashathon if anybody can tell me You can't claim your rewards. How does this work? 
Um, rewards can be stacked. For example, if you use 24,000 gems to hatch pet eggs, you can receive all the rewards stated above. Um, rewards will be sent to your in-game mailbox within three days, business days after the event ends. Please contact. So you just do it and because it doesn't show you how much gems you've spent, you have to do math. Um, there's no indication of what's happening. It's just you spend hopefully the amount you think you do and then wait for the rewards to come into your mailbox after the event has ended. That's stupid. IGG, you have to change this. This is a stupid event. <laughs> Excuse for me. It's not a stupid event. It's a good idea. I see what they're doing here. I did it because I want to max up my Fennec. But why can't you just claim the rewards after you've done the event? I'm finished um, hatching the eggs, which takes a hell of a long time. Let me just go and claim my eggs, please. Plan for prizes. Is that on? Because they have, if that's on, I've got quite a few to... What? I used 15,000 gems. Oh, it's up until the 14th, I just wanted to say. You gotta be kidding me, man. Well, that's it for the video, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers.